Hello friends, today we'll discuss random walk model with and without drift and simulation of it in Excel. So first of all, we should need to know what is random walk model actually. So random walk model is like a person who is drunk and just uh, moving randomly on the street. In the same way, uh, we have random walk model that is just simply accumulation of the errors it is having on the T point of time, till T point of time. So here we have two kind of random walk model without drift and with drift. So, and its simulation I have shown here. So, we'll go step by step. So, first I need to remove all of them just to be, about, be clear about it. And uh, so, now we are completely blank here. So, first we need to simulate, like, suppose how many times you want to simulate here. So, T, suppose I want to fix at 1, 2. Uh, I go from fill, series, in the columns, till. I take 1000 values here, okay, so 1000 values, T point of time, suppose daily series we have here, and the errors we will just randomly generate here by the norms inverse function, norms inverse function, here say norms inverse, normal standard inverse, this is the function we are searching for, and for probability we are mm, simple mistake here, Random. So now it's okay, I think. Done. So this is simply and drag it over the complete 1000 line. And so here now we need to know what is random work model without drift. So at yt is equal to yt minus 1 plus error at t point of time. And these errors I have generated are normal distribution with 0 mean and 1 standard deviation. So here suppose I say for simplicity I take y0 is equal to 0. So okay, it's simply nothing but so at y1 is nothing equal to y0 plus error at t point of time that is 1 enter and here it is equal to uh, yt minus 1 plus error t point of time and uh, the same i can drag here so here we can see this is so if we uh, put here f9 uh, we can see simulate here uh, how many so many times you need so this is simple simulation of random walk model without drift suppose you want to add here add here drift drift suppose for assume purpose it's three okay now we start here it's equal to uh, uh, here we can say it is alpha that is nothing but drift and plus drift plus uh, y0 uh, that is yt minus 1 plus the error we have here and, uh, and here is equal to uh, drift again to fix it I put here uh, dollar sign plus fixed reference I am putting here and uh, plus y t minus 1 y t minus 1 is nothing but this and plus error term that is this and, and I just double click it so now I can see this is a straight line I can see here that is uh, drift both the models are non-stationary and just to make the stationary what we need to do simply take its full difference so if we can see if we change the drift like suppose it's y what is the difference in both of them and uh, suppose if we just change and if we change why it's not changing i think some problem here drift at y t minus 1 it's three y it's f2 okay so this is we are seeing a simulation we can put many times we know shift f9 okay so now we can see this here f9 again and again how many times we need this we can change here suppose we take drift 20 again the drift drift 2 we can test how many times we want this is random work model uh, thank you